Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. In this video I will show you how you can create AI animation and uh, the sample of this process would be actually the one you're looking at right now. It's a very simple method and every single program which I'm going to use in this tutorial is actually free. So without any further ado, enough love, I will provide you with actionable value. So make sure that you follow every single step which I will do in this video and the end outcome will really be amazing. So make sure that you smash up the like button, subscribe to the channel and let's get straight into it. So basically what we are going to do is to generate some really cool images and then we are going to convert those images to the actual AI animation. So to create AI images, I'm going to use Leonardo.ai, a very simple tool to use. It's completely free to use as well, and it has a ton of features. So here under the community creations on this page, here you will find a few of the samples. I think that those images are really, really well generated and are quite realistic as well. But before we begin with creating images on Leonardo.ai website, make sure that you guys use the link in the video description down below and upgrade to one of more premium versions of Leonardo.ai because with the free account, you will only get about 150 fast tokens, which is really a shame that it's not a lot. But if you guys use some of other models like Maestro Unlimited, you will get around 60,000 fast tokens and these tokens also also reset monthly so I think it's totally worth it and it doesn't cost you actually anything more if you use the link in the video description below so with that said let's go here to the first page now once here we are going to actually create very simple 3d render of a spider-man for example now here on this page you will navigate here to the ai tools under the image generation and here i already have some of the examples which images you can basically create now here i have this simple prompt which i came up with while searching for the idea of this video and i will also put this exact prompt in the video description right below the like button by the way now, once here, you will have this simple prompt. Of course, you can modify it whatever you like. And then the most important part here is that we select here the preset. Now, for those images, which you saw in the intro of this video, were generated with the cinematic Kino preset. And once you selected this one, you can then click your, here on the preset style. Now, here you have many of the presets, but I selected here cinematic one. Then for the contrast, I went with the high, so the main character is really nicely exposed and it has some highlights and it actually differs from the background. Now here at the bottom, we also have image dimensions. Now keep in mind that if you are actually making the content for Instagram, for example, then you will need to click here on more and select here, for example, Instagram, which is the aspect ratio or of four by five so make sure that you select that i have here only the mobile version so nine by 16 but you can for example just create whatever image dimensions here you like now under the number of images i went with four but if you have for example more premium account make sure that you use the link in the video description down below by the way then you can even generate up to eight images as well now here under the advanced settings here you will find a model which is going to be used while generating those images here i went with leonardo anime xl and this is pretty much it once you have all the settings here dialed in you can just simply click on generate on the top right and here you will also see how many of the tokens this will actually also take it's around 10 tokens for for images so here i will click on generate i can also show you another method or another preset which already just came out it's called leonardo phoenix and this one will actually enhance your um, prompt as well so if i have the same prompt here you have this option called auto prompt enhance so here it says when activated your prompt is expanded to include more detail so this is really really cool and for preset style i will went with the 3d render and everything else will stay stay the same so here we have every single setting here and now i will click on generate and of course this model will take a lot more of the tokens you can see here about 24 of them and this is why you should definitely use the link in the video description down below and upgrade to one of our premium versions of leonardo.ai 
and it actually doesn't cost you anything more and you get to support this channel by doing so so here down below we have some of the example of the images i think that they already look kind of good and for the bonus tip i will also show you a very simple trick how you can also enhance the end ai video so this is the first model and this is basically the second one which looks like this i think that the first one looks much much better so this is why i am going to generate ai video using this for images so basically on this page you would can just click here on download image just like so and just repeat the process for every single image you created and now the cherry on the top is that we are going to use crea.ai to generate ai video now this tool is also completely free to use and it's very easy to use and i'm going to show you how you can create the exact ai animation which you saw in the intro right now so just go here to the ai video generation and here i have some of the presets which i use for my previous generation and with a free account you get around two to three generations of the video so here once you are on this page you can just click here on the keyframes and you can upload the images which you got from the leonardo.ai and now we have three images in this exact video now for the clip duration here i went with the 10 seconds which is the longest and here down below we also have prompts for example you can create here simple prompt just like dynamic motion of hulk transforming and now we can extend this prompt or add another one if you want to i will just extend it now here you have four of the presets for the style you want to go for for example you have the film one animation render and experimental i will just go here with the animation and then you can also go here to the settings and make sure that the aspect ratio is pretty much the same as of the images you have generated with the leonardo.ai here i went with 9 by 16 and i also enabled loop video so you can basically stitch this video together and it will be even longer so here once you have all these settings dialed in and configured you can then just click here to generate the video and now i will show you how this ai video generated with crea.ai actually looks like and now if you want to enhance this video even further you can just go back to the crea home page and click on the enhancer right here now make sure that you upload the video which you just generated and uh, you actually download it on your computer i actually forgot to do that so i will just go back to video generator and click on download right here and of course the really cool thing about crea is that it doesn't have the ugly watermark on the video so this is one plus why you should definitely use crea.ai to generate those ai videos now let's go back to the enhancer here i will just upload the video which i just got from the crea.ai video maker and here you will be able to upscale this video to only one x so there is no actual upscaling going on here you will have to pay for the premium version of the crea.ai if you want for example 1.5x 2x or 2.5x then for the frame rate which is really really cool and completely free you can enhance this video to go up to 120 frames per second and then you can also go here to the settings and you have here the preset which i will have set to animation and that is pretty much it click on enhance here and right now let me show you the before enhancing the video and after the enhancing the video So with that said, this is pretty much it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure to smash up the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you all in the next one.